Good afternoon once again. I know it's not the best circumstances to say good afternoon, but uh, those of us who are still living, they say thank God for every minute that we have and glorify Him by all the power and all the energy that we have. At this time, I'd like us to stand with our opening hymn, number 530. You might even come and help us with the voices as we begin. When peace like a river, I'll sing. When peace like a river,
we pray, since you saw everything from the beginning, now we ask God, come comfort us. Come comfort the family. Come speak whoever will say anything to bring hope in our hearts. As we continue with these stages of grieving, we pray that speak to your people. We commit everything to you now as we begin and as we end. As we go to our final destination at the end of this day, may your will be done. We leave everything to your care this moment, for we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Let me take this opportunity once again to welcome each and every one of you from uh, the busy schedules that we always have to spare a moment, set aside to pay our last respects to one of our beloved ones who has gone before us. And at this time, feel welcome and whatever that we do, Let's do it as a last respect to the one who has passed on Ezekiel Osano. Uh, this time I want to welcome uh, Uncle James, who is going to introduce the family so that as we speak, we know who we are comforting. Because there are some of us who might not know, maybe his children or maybe his immediate family members. So at this point, I want to welcome. James McKay, who is going to do family introduction. After that, we'll have the first reading from uh, Daniel Masotti, so you can be getting ready. Good evening, everybody. Uh, it's a sad moment that we are here to say farewell to our departed uh, Brother, son, father, cousin, friend, and secular son. A lot of you know who are in here. Know Ezekiel, who was a very radiant uh, personality, outgoing, friendly, and very very hard to know. But he has, he has gone, he has gone now. He lives behind a very wonderful family. Uh, wonderful children, wonderful siblings, parents, and friends, as you are all gathered here. The most important people that he leaves behind is his family. <coughs> and so that's where I'm going. Uh, I'm, going I'm going to begin. As the speaker before me, my name is Jay. My name is James McKay. Uh, the sis is my nephew. His mom follows me. Some people say that mom, I follow the mom. So he is behind a wonderful family of five children. Three of the children are here in the US, in the two are back, back home. Three of the children are here with their mom, and the two are back home with their, their mom. So I'm going to start with that, uh, uh, with the children. And uh, since the time is squeezed, they're not going to speak, but I'm going to have to, uh, two dollars, I mean one dollar here. I always thought he's standing there, and sitting there by the mom. She's, uh, she's 18. And the two brothers are standing, I'm sitting uh, beside her. 
this field and just raise up so people can see. The, uh, the elder one is uh, Nicodemus, and this photo is out. Yeah, next to them is their, their mother, Irene. If you can uh, stand also mm -hmm. in the way of the game. Uh, next to uh, Irene, who is my niece, is uh, Ezekiel's mom. The other family who is back home, the mom, the those kids back home, her name is uh, Peruya. And uh, mm. yeah, her mom is Peruya. And uh, the, the two kids, uh, the two daughters over there, uh, one of them is Chinese, and the other one is uh, Andrew. So from there, let's go on to uh, the brothers or sisters of uh, of uh, Ezekiel's mom. If you are here, can you uh, just stand and wait? Cousins to Ezekiel and Irene and Priya. Can you all stand and wait? Cousins. Uh, the sisters, our brothers to Ezekiel's mom. We are here. Can you all stand? And when I'm talking about, I'm talking about both sides of, uh, from a circus home and the, and the circus mom home. Can you understand? <coughs> the sisters. <laughs> At home, we, call, we say that they are. Uh, uh, I see their cousins from from a second side. And uncles or aunts were here from a second side. The bullies, are you here? The orangas, are you here? We have a very tight schedule, not everybody's gonna be able to, to speak. So if you are here, stand up and wait, please. Sorry that not everybody could uh, could uh, speak. 
because of the time schedule, but uh, that's the, the family that we, we have here. I'm not sure whether I forgot anybody. Uh, the grandma is here. Uh, uh, said his grandma, I mean, you can stand. She's very, yeah, grandmas, yeah. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for the brief introduction. And at this time I want to shift the gears a little bit into quick uh, speeches so that we can be able uh, to finish in time. But before we do so, we have a scripture reading that I said uh, if we can have the reader to come up so that you're going to help us, Daniel. And then after that, Metro Choir be ready. We will present an item and then we go to the second reading. Hello, my name is Daniel Masodi. I will be reading from 1 Corinthians 15.20. But now is Christ risen from the dead and become the first fruits of them that slept. For since the man came death, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. May God comfort us. Thank you, Daniel. Metro Choir for an item, followed by the second reading. Emily, if you can be ready as well.
second reading. The reading comes from Revelation 21, verse 4, and it reads, And God shall wipe away all the tears from their eyes, and there shall be no, no more death, neither sorrow nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain, for the former things are passed away. May God bless the reading. Thank you so much. And at this time, I want to shift a little bit and uh, start some speeches whereby we'll have some uh, representation from the community. Uh, we'll have a uh, representation from uh, the company that uh, Ezekiel worked for most. That is the taxi, that is the yellow cup, and uh, their friends. Uh, and we'll have some representation from there. Then uh, those who are staying with uh, Ezekiel until the fateful morning that he passed on, we'll have also Joseph who will speak uh, as part of that group. And then we'll go to the family. So from the community, I'll call upon the chairman for KUA. That is none other than uh, Jeremiah Manduku, followed by the chairman uh, Umachoge, who was also our devotional leader, uh, Benson Amaya, so that you can say something. Uh, good evening. Good evening. As you have, uh, my name is Jeremiah Manduku, and I'm the chairman of uh, KUA, where uh, Ezekiel was our member for two years. So, uh, on my behalf uh, and on behalf of uh, KUA, I would like to pass our condolences to the family, uh, the kids, the mother, uh, and all the friends who are here. The Seki was a friend to most of us who knew him, and now he has left us five kids and uh, as uh, Mr. Mackay was uh, introducing the family. Uh, it's, it's, it's a big family and I hope that uh, you guys together with the community will be united to make sure that uh, Ezekiel's kids will have the comfort and the guidance that they could have had uh, with their father being around. It's, uh, it's indeed sad uh, to lose a young person as Ezekiel. Uh, uh, it should be a wake-up call to each and every one of us that uh, we might, uh, anything can happen. So as, uh, as, as we grow in numbers in the DFW, we know where the community is heading, uh, join an organization uh, like Ezekiel did. For those who have young kids, uh, make sure you have some insurance or anything that can take care of your kids uh, should, should you go uh, early in life. Uh, I don't have much to say. Uh, I'd say call it uh, uh, on behalf of uh, the KB, as I say. But before I go, Mr. Chairman, if I all the community leaders are here on, on your behalf. If you can stand up and, and wave to the congregation wherever you are. If you are a leader in a community organization, you can stand up and wave. Okay, that's the chairman over there for Safari. Okay, uh, that's all. Uh, so, uh, so uh, Colin, uh, accept our conferences and uh, may God help you, may God guide you as you go through this uh, process. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Thank you, Benson. <coughs> then from Benson, we'll go to Mother Joseph Wilkoma. Good afternoon. 
Uh, my name is Benson Amayas, you've heard, the chairman of uh, my Chogi Association, where most of uh, the sector's relatives come from. Mary, the sister, is uh, one of our rituals. And on behalf of our association, we want to pass our condolences and comfort to the family. At the same time, as uh, the chairman said, since the second past, we have uh, been meeting at the family's residence uh, every evening, trying to share a word of encouragement from the word of God, which we desperately need at this time, because when death strikes, in most times we have nowhere to turn to except to God. And uh, through this human experience, we have been reminded every time we experience death that we indeed are not here for forever. Uh, this afternoon we were at the funeral home. I overheard, I think it was a grandma to Ezekiel in our anguish, lamenting that she has been visiting Amara funeral home a number of times. Our frustration is uh, common, I think, to every one of us. We are tired of this world, seeing our loved ones go before us each and every time. <coughs> so, uh, the focus therefore remains for us to put our house in order so that when we pass, should we die before Christ comes, we die in Him. And as the scriptures have reminded us, reminded us, there is a resurrection. And that's what we are looking forward to. So my encouragement to each one of us is to go out of this experience, searching our hearts, so that we can do what we need to do to make it right with God. Continue praying for the family, and on behalf of our Pastor Mwebi, who are helping each other to help with the devotion. I want to thank those who came, the elders, the pastors who came, and then carried their family. Continue to pray for them, because this is not an easy experience. They will still need our prayers. And those who can visit, visit the families, you can see with that. Otherwise, we thank you so much, and may God bless you. And Kyoso Morako Kyoma is coming up. How many of us don't understand Kisi? By a show of hands. How many of us don't understand Kisi? Okay, so we have about three or four people. Uh, Pastor, you understand Kisi, so about five people. So what I'll ask, we also have some mamas, Muna Mahokoro Gali. So as we speak, I'll encourage us to mix. Because let's be flexible. We mix the languages because we can take care of both. Because if we start translating for every word to word, we'll be here for a long time. So I think that is the best way we can save time. Since I came to Texas 2003, that's been my first friend uh, before I knew we would have a sorrow. 
Ukoiri wa chitawa swa mae Tua veda amo Ande urmost Kila di tu kumukwa na tu nere Usi mwa tu nere Te te hi a jete ko Usi ra Tua rengi nere On the Friday Up to around 11 o'clock Night Nkaru wa nga motiga Tua ka Aba rengi uvia And then, I'm being a good ago. Good ago, rang twelve. Which day, I'm going to rang you and sell us a coach is good. Could you have argument? We can you open with a room, we never say you could do it. And that's it. So, what do you do? Do you get it? Esa que es la que fue 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 la Awak tu aku jenar dua kawan no, dua kawan nanti tiga jenar ayo. Awak tak awak kena dua some of the people that work in there, awak dia balik sekolah hari tu main tu sunda nak tu dia mahang yang lain. Jenar ayo, ayo. Aku tu jenar ayo dia mana aku tu jenar lagi. Ayo, ya, ya. Untuk mana ada hari, ada nanti yang tiga. Okay, kalau dia nak sekolah for some time, nak nyusut ke perkaraan dia guys. Abang tu nak abang tu balik sekolah. Mungkin mana? Bukan. Oh, ano? Ini kita terapa. Ok, nak kau buat tu muntah tu. Puna nom nama tu cerita yang dia kuliah. Ah, sekolah ini jalan musang mana? Ita ni mui. Jangan bincang itu, anda itu boleh duduk dengan kepala rusin barol. Aduh, mahu ikan, aduh mahu nak kumur, mungkin rumah. Insamus, apa tu mahu non? So, ini nak yang tayar kau, ini yang tayar kau nak bikin kita terakar. Dia mana? Dia mana? Solusian, dia mana? Angge power, sah. Thank you so much. Let's have Joseph or Nyabayo who is uh, one of the roommates uh, of uh, Ezekiel. Joseph, if you are here, you can come up. Joseph Nyabayo. I thought I saw him here. Any of the roommates? Okay, I'll move on uh, from there. Let's go to some of the neighbors by uh, Ezekiel. Abu, who have been staying close to him uh, all along for many years. Uh, you mean to Kongo, uh, not to Kongo, but uh, Kisuma. Are you around? There are some people who are outside. We have some spaces over here you can come in. Mwaka Kisuma. If he's not here, Mukamba, if you can come up. Saya mula 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 sejaman, sekian hingga ringe orang mana, anda rumah jalan, anda tua mata mana, I'm sorry for the young Americans probably will get translations from the because the majority speak this. I apologize for that. Sekian hingga orang mula mula anda tua jalan. Kami ni nelayan itu, macam tuan mesti tahu mana. Kalau tuan mesti nelayan, ayat itu ka, itu ka mana? Pada Yulis, ada tu kami ni nelayan yang kita ni mak. Kalau tuan mesti nelayan Yulis, kalau tuan itu kan orang orang di family itu kalau tuan leka, awak yang bawa itu tu sekejap tu kalau dia tu tu suke. Boleh, jepol kita ni ni orang macam grapevine. 
To summarize, a sector was a strong man from where he comes from. It happens to live the boundary. The man says the kissy. So we have lost the warrior. So what I'm saying, Pastor, we have lost the warrior in the community from where I come from, those who can be able to understand. Finally, I want to appreciate the commitments of our people because other communities, they don't have that togetherness that we have. I want to urge those who are not joined the organizations because it gives us each time when we have a difficulty like this. Our organizations are still fighting, they are joining hands so that we can hasten our problems when especially we have a problem. So Germans, so different organizations, to the old Hong Kong, we have some of the top of the year, to the top of the top of the top, our past of the top of the top, and we have a problem with the top of the top, and we have a problem with the top. Now we have a problem with the top. Na inchi na asili ya ekule ya mwaya wa sasa ya mwaya tukuni kwa yetu Na wana 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 utu kwa yetu Na wana 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 yetu Onye mwote ni tuto ya kwa haki ya ni hindi ya hindi ya hindi ya amerika Inu kwa boksi ya kusi ya ya Kwa hindi ya wasi Toro na hindi ya hindi ya hindi ya hindi Na kwa hindi ya hindi ya hindi ya hindi ya hindi Na kwa hindi ya 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 hindi Kwenye mwono mwa wata mwana mwange wa mwone ndo mchu Kwa kini rende ato kwa hindi vile Bia mwana sila singi ya wakana With that I want to shift the gears to the family members And I'll be remiss Kwenye ting kwenye mwana sese ya ya wede Na wata wande wa mwago And with that I want to call upon you your mentor Orenge If you can say something then we have Jacob Uhundi Rafa もう最近なしや。じゃなしも最近。ワキメテネル。タイムスクールやもう。プライマリー。タイムスクールやもう。セカンダリー。ベカウナーティティ。あなたがもう何年来るか。セキュリティを受けると、ベキュリティを受けると
That is the sister to Mama Ezekiel. Nere okumoro wa kurumaiga. Nori okutanga na wakwana nere omanene asimuavo. 
baba nko kwate kendora kwane awon kala tari konda o he yanko bate ni wo ile wo yamwesi kibono nda ke kwane o se na kwane na rosire ya ya no iweta to gi uga wote na bari ko rindu ko wo cho cho konya ya Abang buat tu bukan yang konen, agak aku kira, kira ni yang kita orang hakir juga. Yang buat kita orang kita dia, tinggi pura. Wan orang ini jangan kita yang mesti sabar. Nah ini kita ini kita juga nak tahu apa. Wan orang ini orang mesti kau kabir orang itu orang ini orang mana orang ini orang ini orang itu kabir. Orang ini orang itu siapa orang itu kabir. Kau yang nak buat dia muka itu baru kena cuma nak cuma nak kita mereka tu mereka ini. Kabi sebab ada yang kita awal isi ke nyonya kita aku bawa nyonya ni dah kerang ani jadi mama. Nampak ada buat cie tinggal kerja gitu bawa yang kita lakukan. Tapi ada mana yang dia tiada kerja kau mahu ada lagi tak kira? Tak aku buat itu. Entah itu dia itu nampak ni. Tuli kerja orang mana? Nampak kerja dia ti. Ia ikan mana tuli mitu itu yang si mana tuli ika? Nampak orang nyonya orang muda tapi kalau nyonya orang ni na nyonya orang ni sih. Kalau orang pinjau tu yang cuma sabar ngasai, mahu sabar. Kenapa yang kita bawa nampak orang mahu ada lagi kerja itu kerja itu kiri. Piyamano ina herengi na koro nyago sira kwa ya metro na moko na kuweka tiyale kia gera mshifting gears to the inner core ya familia ya iga na chinga kia chiga nda rangeli amos oyo ra kwane then Mary if you have something to say awana wa wana wa mwavo nyago sira alo Kosinya kan, tunggu kucak aku, kosinya kucak kira. Sekiranya orang kau buat, asih minto, orang romong nama mama, iko nama aku iko lepas aku kuat. Kesekiranya rota tangan di Amerika, naik dengan aku ruka, tangan ini aku merawan. Orang itu arah kolej gas, ia mu, tu aku kasar aku, tu aku kolej gas. Naik deh, naik dengan kita Amerika, tak jadi tu tiga. Nafas di Tuah tuah ikan tak kawer, asal muka kau yang mana entah kau, nanti yang kanyang orang kon 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 dia tak mampir Amerika. Asal wujudnya, abu ya abu ya seke no bongke, no bong dah dah temu kau bokoh, nara kinting kau bokoh ora. Dah bah dah bah dah bah ager wujud wujud sana sapa, kita si muat muat bermu kokor, kau kau tiga jika asal kau cek kerja entuk bin tu bin obi ons bi, kau jaga tuah pol. Kita ini nanti nak bongke apa pol? At the same time, we are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. We are going to be able to do the same thing. Nah, Rusi itu one of my best person. Oh, yo kau nyawa rogon sihira. Rana ini kau mak kau nyar kau manye binte binke, you know, ini prosesian kita yang terlete. Tapi saya sihir ini dah buat tapi power. Nah, ini ini tu sahaja ni tu bekas sama sahul. Asanti. Pihak mana, Mary? After Mary, we'll have a Bible di bawahnya. Arafu Irene. Tomaikoenda <laughs> Muka kerja kini wajar, awak nampak ada yang kita bagi kereta nanti yang kaki na. 
Baka una diga, en jinguito garibna na guato mumuru minto orenge kumanyanga muisko minto monena nera atuari atuari ngi jingi ya. Jena ma tenga ni jingui garitu kiri mo, ngi nde mo chori jingo shobi sandu kie, jingo chori kala which kala is the best for my brother. Useli yoga kiara be kiri wasi sandu. Ni imagine tenga I'll be the one. To be shopping for his casket. Na mire kente kiko, tima eti kose kero monto na wai weta se fa mire buna ni weta eki agero yorali re with my dad. Those were like my my immediate to my life. Kero na chete Kenya, who visited my dad, he passed almost the same time, the same thing like Ezekiel. I lost him less than a week. I was in the, in the shopping, shopping the casket for my dad. And here I am, shopping for my brother casket. He took a cigarette, he was saying he took a cigarette, basically he died on Saturday. The Baba pronounced it on 24th, but to me, the way now, Roger, he got a cigarette on Saturday. But then they sing a Jenny guitar, a process, they could not pronounce him on Saturday. That's how I feel. On that morning, on Saturday morning, he sent me um, Tindaponyasom. But in our 5 14 in the morning, he sent me something on Facebook. Kegote um, Vanga Heaven at last, God gift. So in Jang Akir to Kwali Kindaid, Nalian to Meritagan take five foot in the morning, Timadiga at the Vogata Karatigana around Okwali, in Chibata on Nalingon or a call, Komogwati, Ganyora Ganyora Naling. So Swalmu Achiro to Apol, Biamona, Pastor Biamona, so to allow my brother. The family in Biamon, um, Alvin, Nikki, and time. Um, I'm always there. I'm always here. If you need anything, just come for for help. Um, I'm, I'm the way in the close to my brother. I'm sure I'll be closer to those boys. That's how I feel. Yeah, mano. Uh, this time, Tigango Ndete Narango Mongena, Mama Joyce Noali and Gaiga, Timothy was out of Moana school. Noali, hey, what you took one? Raf Korwara, Mamma Ezekiel, Oveang. I am back when I am seeing the amole. The amole na ende. Twenty na batole no moicha no. Manga akwani no. Cheti no icho kwa na kende. Bona ala kote bikora. Ababa singo kwenye wali. Moicha no utgali ta sole na sende. Hai no muburaka. Na inche no muburaka. Intu intu tora chamo. Havana Wakin. Side in Yako was in ya. You all want to be a Corana Kiyawa. Taco what is Nini Watamon or Tavanga, Vana Vera Vambra, Mary Wakwani, Anga Watavanga, Irene. A carabibian was soon building a guitari. Dangle it over and come. No one Ria rubwa tu mano umochano monene wogo kumiya. Inche na riko basabe fa mirmuens. Mano libi biani haroisa no yo no yo inali. Taka nyogo teba wana baviri. Ya ya. Mano ni ero le problemu ane ne. Ni ero geli na mani re miyake yansi. Wano mano li na endega mani te mano. Weta na nyama mumuwa. Kwa nariko basa ba, simako anachini yomba chini. Masaba manene moja wichi asomwa na uliya. 
Kerjanya ada PC, ukuran lagi dogo. Cinta cinta ni kau buat. Iga kau. Ika bana bawa ni. Tapi tak cerah bana bawa ni. E family kau bana besi kiri ni. Poli ni ada besi kiri ke sakup nak kau rata abang adi ane. No ere. Jadi nara maya nara kau besa bera. Eh, nain depan ada sana so sedih sih kiri kerana ni kerana kerana kiri. Lagi ni, sih kiri itu kerana mana? Awal lagi anak pada kenya, mubuat terane mule ini. Amu sih makam mata yang ini family yang sih kiri. Amu sih nak buat family yang buat apa? Nampak nampak no iya. Tak aku nyara buika, buika mubuat terane makam ini family yang ions. Iwa tiga nyara sabar sih ni, sabar dia bengi ya. Saya kahwin je, anda tahu mana nak hidup ya mama. Ya mana mama? Biar mana seliba, pasta, makiras, abah na abah na. Aba cukur, aba kau ni dua, itu dua biaya mana? Aida ni ringan biaya mana seliba? Nanya ni dua biaya, aku kau nasi muka nanti sanduk kira bosan. Bosan juga aku kau nanti. Nanti tak mesti nanti macam siapa ni dah. Nanti kalau nanti tu muka muka nanya kita dia ni tengah ini tengah aku cakap orang muka nanti tadi aku kau nanti. Nak yang berarti kan tu dia konen kerang guru kat kuli siring kau nyara bantu. Tapi tu mata tu bos bapa bantu gua kian mais. Hak tu mana orang ni kau nyara bantu bapa bayi ceri gua ini. Kau nanti nak nak korang rasa muda kau ikut kau mau ikut kau mana kau ya nanti kau irang kau mau ya ni nanti kau ira itu na maru bana ni tering tering korok kau ni kau kian tu dia konen tu. Kau lembaga kau ambil orang kau. Kau kau ambil orang kau. ご視聴ありがとうございました<音楽><音楽> Unamana na hari kita ngah bana bawa barang unah bawa kau dendam tinggal waktu kami juga. Aku mau mau tu sebenar ni bana bawa kini. Tinggal waktu kini na cinten cikuru hari udah kini bana tinggal hari kau nanti kau kini dua hari. Aku nanti nanti rumah kau nanti rumah kau nanti. Nanti kau cakap dah dua hari juga aku nanti cikuru dendam bana bawa kau kini aku nanti kau nanti kau kini kau dah tak lagi. Aku kau nanti kau nanti kau nanti. Pole pole. Ah. Metro Choir, if you can give us an item. Metro Choir, if you can give us an item.
mono i think uh, i renew the takire gukwa na rakini saying encho ya the emotions of where we were that's why na rangelie kwaya ya chama mapema ake before their time gocha he go at this time i renew if you can speak then ya bana ba manyako to achi poem or the tribute gocha says it so I know we are in darkness, it's hard. But I thank God, she's 17, actually she's not 18, she's 17 years old. January she's turning 18. But I thank God for the 17 years Actually, she has done it. And she, she has really done it. Actually, she has really done it. You become strong. That's what I believe. I'm a sabonigan to Kiamana. And I thank Pastor Mwebi for raising up my kids. Pastor Mwebi, I don't know if you have a second say, you have a baby, you know, but also I want to one. I thank God. My boys, listen to me. I know you have been raised in church. I know you will be there for mom. Nick, now dad is not there anymore. Be strong. Now you're going to be the leader in, in the house. And my little lawyer, I call him my lawyer because he asks a lot of questions. Sometimes you wonder, where did he get all this from? And believe me or not, he talked to me until the last minute. You, the people who were there, they witnessed. Where the party where we were, people witnessed. They were shocked. They were like confused. What's going on? You guys, what's going on? But Ezekiel went to his knees. They are right at the party, and they were abiding. Na ago sabire onyabere. Okono konga ino. Ogo tamanya. E kagera e family ya ne kagenda iga. But na ago sabire onyabere. No nyenya sanya bere na ende mbu ya mono baba aso ko ndendera bana tiganya sago nsesenelie oke ndere ko ndendera bana i wish i knew that is any i wish na ma itanga no ko eri ari ko ngakera hm i wish na ma nyete and they kept sending me uh, text message ko ko ntomera chi fases the last fase he sent me i think it was meant for the family pastor it was Deuteronomy 5:16-21, and that's a serious fast. I wish a family take into consideration. understand. anything. In fact, in Anchire, in Angel, the American, they do their thing. Last year, I took a for annual where in the meetings, they, they said both parents, you have to be there. So I had to tell Ezekiel, we have to attend the meeting. So when we went there, they said, you know, she's going now under transition. So what you have to do, you have to write a will. So both of us, we were scared. They said, yeah, you got to have to write a will. So 
I had to tell a second. I say, Kira, no, you go to Navanta. But I think what a Morike will does not mean I was ever on which you could see a Morego, someone on which you could see. It's a recommended and it's a requirement because with her existing condition, you have to write a will. Talk about they give us time and then we go right. To me, I went ahead and I, I wrote the will. Ezekiel, nganya kumovoli kuali, nkuali kwa ne will nga king nga king kona kanya rachi email iga, and I'll do it. I'll do it. Actually, the last uh, three weeks we were supposed to go to another annual meeting. I, probably they were going to ask for for his will. So I was like, I wish maybe he had written his will so that we could know what we are supposed to do because I'm now in darkness, I don't know what to do. But guess what? My will is there, my boys, they already know, my will is at school, they can check. And Because I, when Ezekiel passed on, I had to go ask. They said, no, we, we were waiting for the will for the next annual meeting. But then they go but God, the living word we serve, he knows me, Ezekiel knows me than anybody else. And I should know Ezekiel more than anybody else. Even the co-wife home, I believe she doesn't know Ezekiel as much as I do. Because I've been living with Ezekiel for years. With her, I can count maybe it's a year because he goes home like a month or two months to count it up. I, please pray for my family and my boys be obedient as you always do and listen to mom that's all I request a lot of things will not help I will be so happy. I really need a Right now, I'm in darkness. I'm so, so stressed. Eh? Actually, expecting maybe I will be back sooner so that I can keep on moving. Now I'm in darkness. I don't know what next, what's next, what's next. But the living God we serve is there. God bless you and thank you for coming. Piamano, uh, Tigango, it's time for the kids to give their tribute to Tato Mwavo, and we'll start with uh, Alvin, if you can come and read something for your dad, and then uh, Nick, you can come up as well. Hi, um, my name is Alvin Obazo, and... Um, I know how everybody's feeling because my dad, he really touched my heart. My dad was everything. Um, on behalf of Alvin, I'll be saying his poem. You never said I'm leaving. You never said goodbye. You were gone before I knew it, and only God knew why. A million times I needed you. I mean, a million times I cried. If love alone could have saved you, you never would have died. In life, I loved you dearly. In death, I love you still. In my heart, you hold a place that no one could ever fill. It broke my heart to see you, to lose you, but you didn't go alone. For parts of me went with you the day God took you home.
Thank you, James, for helping you, cousin. And uh, Nick, can you be able to do it? Then after that, Mike, if you can come for a special item once the eulogy has been read. Hello, my name is Nick, and um, I'm Ezekiel's first son, and I made a poem for him. If tears could build a stairway and memories were a lane, we would walk right up to heaven and bring you back again. No farewell words were spoken, no time to say goodbye. You were gone before we knew it, and only God knows why. Our hearts still ache in sadness, and secret st tears still flow. What it meant to lose you, no one will ever know. But now we know you want us to mourn for you no more, to remember all the happy times life still has much in store. Since you'll never be forgotten, we pledge to, to you today a hallowed place within our hearts is where you'll always stay. Thank you. Hello, church. Um, today I'll be saying the eulogy of my uncle Ezekiel. Ezekiel was the second born child of Mze Andrew Nyaga Gechore and Mama Anna Nyabonyi Makai. He was born at Bubasi Bomesichi Kisi County. He attended Nyamatera Primary School and later joined Regena Secondary, graduating in 1992. In 1998, an opportunity arose for him to come to the U.S. where he established a home working for several years at DFW Airport as general manager, Texa Texaco chain stores, and later driving a yellow cab taxi until his last days. He loved driving around. In 2000, he met his love, Hailene Hy Marira, and they were blessed with Vivian, Nikki, and Alvin. In 2009, he met another love and married Belia in Kenya where they were blessed with Shanice and Andrea. He also survived by his mom, Anna, siblings, Mary, Amos, Evans, Matonu, Machuki, Alice, Helen, Jennifer, and Conceptor. Things went wrong on Saturday, September 22nd, when he woke up and with a severe headache and poor vision. His his friend, Uganda, called an ambulance after noticing that his symptoms were getting worse. At the hospital, he was diagnosed with an acute hemorrhagic stroke, depriving his brain of oxygen and increasing intracranial pressure. On Monday, September 24th, doc doctors did a test that detected that there were a little to no brain activity and pronounced him dead. Um, now, before I uh, leave to give the mic to the chair, to the master ceremonies, I'd like to present my poem that I wrote for him. Our lives go on without you, but nothing is the same. We have to hide our heartache when someone speaks of your name. Sad our hearts, uh, sad are the hearts that love you. Silent are the tears that fall. Living without you is the hardest part of all. You did so many things for us. Your heart was so kind and true. And when, and when we needed someone, we could always count on you. The special years will not return when we all are together. But with the love in our hearts, you walk with us forever. Thank you. Thank you so much. There was actually a tribute in here from uh, the mom uh, to her son. And at this time, I want to welcome uh, Aunt Doris, if you can read on her behalf. If you can. And after that, then we'll have uh, the family, if you can uh, do a special item. 
and then we'll move to the pastor. I'm going to read this on behalf of Ezekiel's mother, Annie. It reads, uh, <coughs> Ezekiel, now I, uh, I worry to be a man or a man or a Awana wa mawabia. Na on the wins, Awa manene will say, Omoke. Na ni no mano usikira se kenyoro, yons. Na ebinyoro, nebinyoro yons via my tiny. Yani, ah, ere kodi and gia pia wat. Kesena yore twe, um, Tanya ge sanya ore tu tanya ko genda nya gitari na nya aba admitted esekere ne rorenge oneta ya asenka ekranya ore tri bakagocha america na wana rengo mo na waya rengo mogoko omane na se familia ekaba ekwenyora akaba kwenyora abaibori Ah, uh, amana wana wa mwa wa monspi asoko konye minto mbali mbali na nyane ya mate yonsi asa renge konyara na bale gokonya na nyane okongania ah uh, gokonya onda asoko cha america korene na waya renge omwaitano Ekere simi ya ngikerete inye sekeri nye gitari yale uh, nye gitari yale aseri tukeri mo agatonyora na aseri rie etaya yane korenda ase okwegena kwa nye sae uh, ni ima nye tenga omwana onena alenge na yi uh, Na ringe na yeso. Korenda sto kweye na kwanya sae. Uh, ni mwanyi denga omwana wane. Na ringe na yeso. Ekerati mwagete. Mwono. Ama sabane. Na mwanchito omwana wane. Korenda nye sae. Na mwanchito mwono. To sabe na nye. Na wana waye. Watano, abuga tigire, magega, amo, no mwangi na waye. Asante sa kwa tegele na mwangi na inara ya Ezekia Rizimamu. Ana, thank you. Uh, let's have uh, a family. Aso kwa tera, and then kuruwaroro tumanya kwa genda si pastor. Family. Mababa nge senge njoye chinsa.
so much for a very wonderful rendition and at this time I want to welcome uh, the speaker of the hour who will give us a word of encouragement and that is none other than one of our own Pastor Mark Heavens Schumer. Pastor, welcome. God is good and all the time the only time that I remember meeting Ezekiel was right here on this campus. There was a function here on a Saturday night. And uh, our cars were parking our cars at the back here. And as we came out of our cars, we encountered each other. And I greeted him in, in my language. And he answered me in his language. And then I knew that uh, we needed to speak in the colonial language. For the next few minutes, we just talked about the challenges of being a man from Africa. A man from Africa who is living in America. We laughed. We became serious about it. And then when we were parting and coming into the hall, uh, we agreed that the only way that an African man will make it in America is because he is being helped by God. And then he said to me, Pastor, pray for me. And I said, I will not promise to pray for you because I probably will forget. And so we went behind his car. And there we prayed. We just held hands and I prayed. So that uh, when uh, Amaya Benson asked me to speak, I 
was surprised that the ceremony was being held right here on these grounds. I say that to say that each one of us here has his or her own experience with Ezekiel. My experience with him the last I remember of him while he was alive is that we're at the back here talking to our God who is in heaven. And therefore as we conclude and pass him on to his keeper allow me simply to say to Ezekiel and to our community. Friday, but Sunday is coming. Allow me to say the best is yet to come for which the past was but preparation. Allow me to say whipping my endure through the night but joy cometh in the morning. Allow me to say even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death I will fear no evil because because the book says yay 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 I am with you I am with you. And it says, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. I am saying this book is a book of promise. This book says, believe in God. Believe also in me. In my father's house are many mansions. This book tells me the Lord is my light and my salvation. Of who shall I fear? I am saying dear friends Friday he has been placed on the cross. The question is, if a man die, can he live again? Saturday, the philosophers are arguing about if this man dies, can he rise again? Sunday, the question is asked, what are you doing among the dead. For he is risen. He is no longer under or death where is your sting or grave where is your victory. And that's why I say Friday but Sunday is coming. The book says in John chapter 3 verse 16 Whosoever believeth should not perish but have everlasting life. Therefore today I must be able to say to Ezekiel even as your body is laid back to the dust I have the personal assurance that your spirit is safe in the heart of God. I have the assurance that, that Psalm number 23 shares with me. Let me share with you what Psalm number 23 says. I sit down. Psalm number 23 says the shadow of death is that shadow? Yeah, that's the word I'm looking for. All right. <laughs> you got right. it. All right. A Kuba shadow. is getting it. Yes. Yeah. A shadow is anything that interrupts the sun. So, when I am right here, you see my shadow. If you see a big dog that bites, 
And you step on his shadow. The dog does not fear anything. Because all you are stepping on is a what? Right. Shadow. You are never afraid of a shadow. Because it is a temporary interception between the light object. That is why anyone who believes in God cannot be afraid of the shadow of death. Because it is a temporary thing. That is why Psalm 23 says even when we walk through trouble, we have the assurance that God that is why it says, He prepares a table before you in the presence of your enemies. And that means that in life, if you are a man, living in America you will have enemies did you hear what I said? Mm -hmm. just the other day there is a man who was in his own apartment minding his own business and somebody opened the door into his own apartment and killed the man the challenges of being a man in America. Today we are saying to Ezekiel, the sting of death has beaten you. But goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. And the book says, and you will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Let me close. Is that okay? I worked in Swaziland in 1974. I was in. Uh, and when I left after a year, the old ladies gave me a pen. They gave me a pen. Something like this. Something like this. They came, I went back to Zimbabwe. In 1982, I was carrying my pen. And I was telling my daughter not to play with my pen. But she played with my pen. And there was a hammer on the floor. A hammer. And I looked at her. And I said, put down the hammer. Put down the hammer, not Lolo. And she looked at me smiling. And she took that hammer and she broke my pen. I love my pen. It was in pieces. I looked at my daughter. Two years old. She did not mean to harm me. To cause me pain. She had no idea how much I loved my pen. But she broke my pen. The wife came at five o'clock in the evening from work. The wife came from. She found me sad. She found me sad. She said, "What happened?" I said, "Your daughter. Your daughter has broken my pen." Your daughter has broken my pen. And she said to me, why are you worried? Have you ever looked at the box that came with this pen? And I said, no. She said, let me show you. And when I opened the pen, it came from England. And inside the box, there was an inscription written. If ever you have a problem with this pen, send it back to the manufacturer. Send it back to the manufacturer. Today our pen is broken. The zikel is broken. But the book has told me, send him back 
to the manufacturer because Friday but Sunday coming. Thank you so much, Pastor. Thank you so much for such a wonderful, encouraging message. At this time, I want to welcome our brother Mike, who is going to lead us on our congregation song, song number 428. And then uh, after that, we'll have a family dedication uh, led by Pastor Mwebi. And then we'll welcome the funeral directors who are, who are going to lead us after the vote of thanks to view the body. So, Mike. The song is sweet by and by, 428. There's a land that is fairer than day. I'll sing. There's a land that is fairer than day, and by faith we can see it afar, for the Father is over. This is a special time. We want to dedicate this family to the hands of God. As the word of God says, I lift up my eyes to the mountains. Where does my help come? from my help comes from the Lord the maker of heaven and earth he will not let your foot slip he who watches over you will not slumber the Lord will keep you from all harm he will watch over your life the Lord will watch over your coming and you are going both now and forever. 
America gatewa karo kuri ringa ngai wano okonya kago kuri seke ringa taiyo iga America wate ringa okonya pa okora dwas nyasa nyasa oyo iga oyo tonge te gorunense oyo ta tige okoro kwa okogo chwe na ende tariko sundoka ata koro chie sore omone ne na korende koro ase wako mbonde bwensi na nanya ro kulenda asu mabwa wens omonene na kulende ekeroko so na ekeroko genda bono na weka kale na kale omonene na barende to sabamu motunge to at this moment on to at na sore oyo minde se kiritayo mono che bune amate ye kumetinga kimono bakaba mongina etaya ya yarimire abana Wono kwa kuri kwa ringi kwa ra kuiyo wana kile kwa kile kwa mani kituo kwa saba kwa rende ba tumira wantu ba tebinga na ora mna bara kwa no bara rende na bako soka na rende na bako sawa no bara rende kile bako nyoro bokongu kile bako no mogo kwa na kile mogo kwa tayo amaruere kile aro na kile tayo no bara rende abana besi kile ba tiga ira abansi ba tu irue tu ababe kila samo kwa Asenchile ya bene umotangi uwese kieri yoko uviviani. Neru watu mchando mwena safi ya yomo nene. Tuwa mubi kila samo waka okoreke kone kia asu mwanoria. Irindi umubiro yenere okore obebuya. Irindi ubuyabuchi ase ya mate na vaiburi wali wamure ndete. Ama na wana bonsi ya besi kieri yoko mwena batika ire. Tuwa mubi kila samo waka o in the presence of these witnesses. Abaiburi waaye. Na boi yuko na ba mwabo, na ba iri ba ye, ya mate yonsi, asumu saini kano yo, tuwa bikira sa moka o. Bwone kere wala akole kuruwa bakuruwa seka nisee seke iri atewe tenga ngoi cha ringa aloracha kukwana, tanyo ale tiri bagi iriyo, kurende ya mate ya anyo ili baga iri ya ligo cha kukwana, isa wa tiri yomo iri ya ligo cha kuruwa sa usi wense. Bwona ba achiri ba kwani na umo nene, iwa ogo sa ba kwabo, iwa ebire rubi abo. Woko wako genda wane sibara aruwa haki wichi kubuati omo nene Vaire vya Na hawa tuwe nsiturega Tuwire vya Onsi ya koreke Unese kiri hata veta seta wiki riki ya egi hata Tenono misa hane kimu kumina sita wiki kemi nangwe ne kemo Uku igwa na wacha se ya mateji Tuwa sayo nuku ina kwa tegure We thank you God We dedicate this family to your care From now and forever As long as they stay in this life As they move from here God we put them to your care, bring unity and harmony in these families and all of us as we live this place. May you are very pitani. We are going to work on our own. And we are going to work on our own. And we are going to work on our own. And we are going to work on our own. And we are going to work on our own. Amen. 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 I welcome uh, Uncle James for a vote of thanks and then we'll do a closing song uh, and then we'll have a word of prayer and then we'll welcome the funeral directors. Yeah, once again, uh, let me take this uh, precious opportunity to First and foremost, uh, thank the one above, the Almighty, for uh, giving us a sequel, the deceased. For the 43 plus years that, uh, that they lived in this world, and the, uh, the family that he has left behind, and the lives and the people that he brought family and friends that he touched when he was living. So thanks to God for, for giving, it, giving us a secure. I must also thank the uh, members of the clergy our pastors of the different churches out here, Pastor Mwebi, Pastor Shuma, 
We also have a lady pastor and the other church, Pastor Liber. These were the first people, I'll call them, they were the first spiritual responders when uh, Ezekiel landed in, in the house, uh, hospital. In fact, they touched him ahead of the doctors. Each and every single one of them over the prayers. So, thank you. Thank you to the churches that we have over here and all the members of uh, the different congregations. Metro, Alpha, All Nations, and all the rest of the members in those uh, different churches for coming together within a very, very, very short time that I've not seen in uh, my stay here. Today is the 21st. Uh, the 21st of October. Ezekiel passed on on the 24th. So you can see we're about uh, 28 days, 29 days. But this community has come up, they have moved in lightning speed to get the family, to comfort the family and to get the family where it is today. Both emotionally and financially. And it's a large family because they've been gatherings, you know, you know where the, the Sega's mom stays, you know, where the kids stay, uh, you know, back home in the, you know, several uh, homes uh, back in the country. The support that has been given has been very, very overwhelming. So thank you for taking the time and putting the resources to uh, help us uh, giving a, a very nice send off. Thank you to the committee members for the time that you have put in. It's been a sacrifice, both in times, in terms of, of, of money and, uh, and resources. All the ladies that have rallied to this cause, they've been visiting Irene and the kids in the house, and the mom where she stays, you know, bringing food left and right, up and down. Thank you so much. We also have to thank the children. Several kids came in there to comfort their little ones. It's a different when the grown-ups comfort the, the young ones, but it's also very, very different when you have their own age mates coming up to, to, to comfort them, to be the ball bearers here, handling the uh, daddy's body. That means a lot. It means a lot to the little ones. And also means a lot because, like Pastor said, you know, we are here temporarily. Every one of us is going. And nobody knows when, uh, when uh, anybody's going to leave. So when we have the little ones joining us over here, when the dad has passed on, or when a grown-up has passed on, that really means a lot. It means a lot to, to them. It means a lot to them. As been said, you know, the family, be strong. Be strong. Listen to your parents, that, to your moms. Work hard in anything and everything that you do, especially in school. Especially in school. If your dad woke walk up right now and ask him what you ask him what he wants you to do, he will say, be obedient to your parents, to grown ups, work hard in school, and carry the torch of the family. Carry the family torch forward for a secure. So, 
Thank you again. Thank you so much. Very sincerely, thank you. We are going to rise on our feet as we sing 473, Nearer My God to Thee. We are going to sing the first, the third, and the fifth. The first, the third, and the fifth stanzas. 473, Nearer My God to Thee. us to the conclusion of uh, today's ceremony of paying the last respects to Ezekiel before his body is flown back to Kenya. And on behalf of the organizing committee, I want to extend my sincere thanks to each and every one of you for whatever that you've done. 
in every capacity you will help this family in every time you've taken to spend with this family we sincerely thank you from here as uh, the funeral directors approach to open the casket we will have soft music playing and then we will be meeting after this event at Ezekiel's house uh, that is uh, on uh, Saguaro Drive where we've been meeting for the meetings so that we can do the last prayer with the family before we disperse. So if you can be able to do it, we really would like to have you there. And with that, may God be with you and keep you until we meet again.
Oh, sure. oh. Sasa, Nico.